Ladies and gentlemen, may I present to you the best shirt of all time. Ohio sucks. It sucks because the Ohio meme is horrible and I'm so glad it has died down because I'm so sick of everyone seeing, bruh, not in, no, only, only this happens in Ohio, bruh. The only spaghetti I'd eat in Ohio, bruh, bruh. Shut up. <laughs> My M&M sandwich only had two M&Ms. Okay, but if you turn it over, are there more M&Ms on that side? Because maybe you got extra M&Ms and there's only supposed to be on one side. Because that looks like a bottom of a cookie, you know? Australian firefighters in Queensland giving a demonstration on how they rescue trapped people on a car that was seized doing donuts for a gender reveal. Donuts for a gender reveal. Bruh, only in Ohio, bruh. See, it's not funny. It's not funny. Satan Claus, 30% off for the world shop. Except Brazil. Yeah, I mean, you can't really discount Satan merchandise for the, the country that has the giant Jesus statue, you know? It'd be kind of, you know, conflict of interest. Poor Scottish Highlands. Yo, no, they're getting covered with yellow snow. Don't eat it, guys. <laughs> Us on our way to fall out of love, quit our jobs, and find husbands. Because user 34628130 said being gay is wrong. I feel attacked. No, oh, that's him. That's literally him. And he's even got the gay rainbow profile picture. You called out the wrong user. You're actually looking for user 34628130. That's the one who's homophobic. Rules apply to you too, Amazon. Packages. All packages need to go to shipping and receiving around the back of the building. No package is accepted past this door. Thank you. Amazon, this means you. You know, maybe if the actual corporation wasn't pushing these ridiculous time limits on Amazon delivery drivers, they would be able to go to the back and drop off the package as needed without getting any pushback from the boss, you know? But no, Amazon is a disgusting company to work for, and uh, they don't care about their employees, and they'll make you pee in bottles, and uh, they want you to die. What did he do? 3,000 days of hardcore Minecraft. Me. I think it's better this way, and your opinion doesn't matter, Aiden. Yeah, Aiden. You suck. Nobody cares what you think this is what works for me therefore you are dumb and you stink actually extremely pretty and they dress well too they get all their dresses in paris i wish i could afford to do the same they say that when good americans die they go to paris chuckled sir thomas who had a large wardrobe of humor's cast off clothes really and where do bad americans go when they die inquired the duchess they go to america murmured lord henry whoa Get them! 2023 Fox Deposits. Foxes are not available to Michigan residences. They are legal in Michigan, but we have made the decision not to sell them in the state. Are we talking about the actual animal? Like, 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 a, like a fox, like a domesticated fox. Or are we talking about cars? I don't know, I don't know what this is. <laughs> Frick Laos. U.S. bombs dropped on Laos 1964 to 1973. The entire island? The entire island. You bombed the entire island, U.S. Really? What did Laos do? They're just, they're just little guys, all right? Frick me, I suppose. Removed by Reddit, your top post of this year. <laughs> Not funny enough, I guess. Even Spotify doesn't like you. Ah, one month free student discount for Spotify, and then $4.99 a month after offer period. Oh, uh, not Quebec, though. <laughs> Quebec, the worst part of Canada. You wish you could be Toronto, or Ontario, or Winnipeg, or or Newfoundland, or, or, or uh, Queensland. No, that's Australia. Queensland, Australia? Yeah. Eh, meh. One star, frozen food warmed. Oh, Iron Horse restaurant and saloon owner. No one cares about your review, Michael. You consistently give one star reviews wherever you visit. Maybe if you spent less time on your phone crying like a millennial and try to be a man, it would actually benefit you. Now, I don't think Michael is a good person for only leaving one star reviews everywhere, but you can tell just by the way that the owner of this restaurant talks, he's a boomer and he probably treats his staff horribly. <laughs> like, he just seems like a bad guy, you know? I don't know. It, it definitely probably deserved the one star review. Duracell really just said, frick you to this kid, huh? Guess which one of these kids isn't in our holiday commercial because their parents didn't power the yaw with Duracell. Hashtag engineered for more. Uh, my guess would be the little Asian baby in the middle left. Uh, I, I, I am just safe to assume that the little man that's crying his eyes out did not get uh, into the commercial. <laughs> Poor guy. T-shirt for sale at the Sturgis South Dakota Motorcycle Rally 2015. Frick Bob in particular. 
Yeah, freak you, Bob. You suck. You probably not, you're you're probably the guy who like uh, domino affected all the motorcycles and knocked them all over, and then got beaten up by a biker gang. No restroom for you, Alex. Alex, no entry. Restroom closed. If your name's Alex. Go find a different restroom, buddy. Amsterdam tells tourists who only come for alcohol, drugs, and sex to stay away. Lots and lots of details about the thing, uh, but this campaign is currently focused on British tourists. And that it should. We need to tell the British to f off. That's the only time I'm gonna actually say the F word in this video, but I think it's warranted. No McMenu for you. Oh God, I can't see a dang thing. Aw oh, snap, is that Google Chrome? You have Google Chrome to show the menus? You don't have like the actual file on, on the computer? Is that not how that works? I'm not a big computer whiz, you know? Five ducks that are all named Matthew, <laughs> with a with an asterisk. Hours of Matthews, zero Gregs, but it may contain Janine. Not this package though. Oh, Matthews, you love to see it. Yeah, frick this area in particular. Porsche new headlight tech. Oh, what? This looks like a glitched image. <laughs> what? This is so weird looking. It's like ominous. I can't tell if the car is focused in its lane or if it's coming right at me. Frick, Brandon409967 on Roblox. You know, this is actually Brandon from Ask MK's R Roblox account. Uh, he is, he's Brandon409967 and yeah, Fork him, dude. He sucks. Just kidding. I love I love Brandon. He's great. Good friend of mine. My son just turned three today. Well, seems like everyone else also turned three today. So out of luck, buddy. You were too late. Paralyzed teen learned to walk again, hit by car, and paralyzed again. God says, stay the F down. Well, now you get to learn to walk a third time. Sorry. I guess no super monkey ball for Dutch people. This game doesn't support Dutch. Please select language you wish to use in the game from the following. English, Deutsch, Francais, Espanol, and Italiano. Well, sorry Dutch. Not like you guys have much to offer anyway. It's the turkey's car now. Second that turkey takes a dump on your car, it is over. You have lost privileges. When his name starts with a J and rhymes with one of the 50 states, y'all leave Jatucky alone. Who is Jatucky? If your name is Jatucky, please respond in the comments. The art for Mike and Sully. <laughs> He's all like scribbly. Everyone else is in their original art style, but not Mike and Sully, they got the short end of the stick. Don't be named Luke, I guess. Per my six-year-old, this is how to get a girlfriend. Wear your hat backwards, be yourself, don't be named Luke. He just randomly said all of that above. I'm sure he did say that. You know, actually, you know, people will tweet random things and say their kid said it. I believe a kid says this. You know, I feel like this is warranted. Merry Xmas to one and all except 482. Uh, you don't get along with your neighbors? They probably deserve it. Neighbors kind of suck. I see you have a security camera up by the door, so I can only assume that they're bad people. So, forget them. Fork you, Chihuahua. P22 to be captured for a healthy valuation after killing a Chihuahua, attacking another. The news release did not say what the next steps could be, but the California Department of Fish and Wildlife said no options are off the table. Okay. <laughs> First of all, shame on the owner of the Chihuahuas for letting them get anywhere near this animal. Second of all, why did the California Department of Fish and Wildlife say no options are off the table? I feel like they could just be a little more vague than that, but I feel like they said that to really do some damage to people who are upset. Frick New Zealand. More people live inside the red circle than outside of it. Yeah, you know, we prefer Australia over here. New Zealand is kind of whatever. Uh, I've never met a single person from New Zealand, but my bosses are from Australia. So I, I, I mean, I know what side I'm on personally. Okay, so we got lockers today and I go and open mine and there was a freaking pole in it! If you're in high school, you don't need to use a locker. You literally don't. Don't kids these days have Chromebooks? Like, get a couple notebooks and a Chromebook, put it in your backpack, you're golden. What do you need a freaking locker for? You carry everything with you. Rhino shower. Oh, 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 I'm so done. Nah, nah, man. Frick you, David. Life throws you a wake up call. Hey David, recognize this? It's your wife, Sock. She lives with me now. She said that she wants to be with a man who doesn't play Call of Duty all day and who is better socially. Sorry David, but sometimes life throws you a wake up call. You can either stay down or dust yourself off and say, this isn't where I want to be, but this is where I am and I must make my way from here. Here are some words for your incredible wife. Don't contact my parents. 
Okay. <laughs> There's so many things wrong with this. First of all, if you have a partner who is spending too much time playing Call of Duty and um, you want them to not do that and maybe help around the house more, get a job, pay more attention to you, communicate, man. Communication's key in a, in a healthy relationship. And obviously this relationship isn't healthy. I'm not saying it's entirely the guy's fault, but it had to have been pretty bad for the lady to leave him for a guy who would put this on a tree. I would assume in, da in David's front yard. This just seems a little overkill, <laughs> you know? 